my second knee replacement is a week from today. And anyhow, I'm trying to uh, look at some video I shot yesterday where I hit pretty good, got some rotation back, and I wanted to go ahead and give this, uh, my, give myself a little description of what I was doing so I didn't forget. And I might use this for some of the people that I worked with. Here's a swing yesterday. Weight on the back foot, transfer the front, and the rotation opens, and the last thing that comes, you just snap. Here's a session I did a few years ago, two years ago, where I hit 15 out of 16 out. And I wanted to see what was the difference. Well, let's look at the lower body. There's a wind on the rear leg, uh, transfer to the front foot, rotate open. They look pretty similar. That's not the difference right there. So I was trying to come over, watch how it snaps over the top a little bit. A little bit of a tomahawk, a little bit of a tilted axe snap on here. And right here, I'm more of a pure side axe snap. I was able to cut it better. Side axe snap keeps me from going outside the rotation. I can go outside the rotation just a little bit, and it's a finer cut on the ball. Here, this pure side axe snap right there, lag to snap, is going to keep me in a better position and on a better plane. Here's, here's a different view of it. Better plane to axe snap and cut through the bottom and still follow the rotation around. If I'm coming over the top, that is really working on a different axis in my rotation, and that's a hard thing for me at 69 years old with uh, one knee replacement, the other one on the way. Rotation, extension, and snap. You know, it's like you're pulling, rotating. The very last thing that comes is the X snap. Rotate, 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 snap. That's how late in the swing that snap has to come. Otherwise, you're getting your body, upper body ahead of it. There's a great lag to snap there. There's a difference, like right here. This is a ball that maybe I hit upper threes. Close to 400 feet. You can see there's a lag, nice long lag to snap. Otherwise, the other ones are a little bit, little bit of mistakes. So right here, the hips could be better. And again, you know, I'm not going to press in, but my physical shape is 69. But watch, watch the back foot. All the weight's kept down there. And watch the back foot turn backwards. You keep the weight on and look at that. Just signifies a coil right before you, you've come off. If you hold that weight there as you come ahead, you're going to really coil. And I'm coming down hard in the front foot here. It doesn't look like it. But I have to force myself to come down hard on that front foot. That's another big key for me. Otherwise, I stay jammed in the back. So here's the rotation. And here's the um, snap coming real late. It's a little bit over the top. Again, I'd like to make that more sideways. You can see that pops over the top. And I think you get more distance. I did that when I was younger. But a pure X side snap, I think, is going to be better. The very, there's your lag. There's your snap. The very last thing to come is your snap. Now, that's a good strike there. But... When you come over the top of that tomahawk, a little bit of a tilted X snap, you're going to um, have less consistency. This is a few years back where, maybe four years back, where weight's on the back foot. I try to do that Brian Wegman where I come down hard on the front foot and angle my body more. And then torque like a crazy man when the front foot hits. And you can see right here, the same principles. You can see rotate, 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 lag, and snap. And then look at the follow through all the way around. Again, rotate, rotate, rotate. So the very last thing that comes is your extension and your snap. So rotation, extension, and snap. And the very last thing that comes is your snap. And if your rotation fails, you'll start to swing with the upper body all the time. So hopefully this will be helpful for me, and I might pass on a few of you guys. Good luck.